Ronald's back, and so's his friend. <laughs> there we have the elephant drinking. You can see the hippopotamus to the right-hand side. And this elephant, I think, is fascinated by Ronald far more than he is threatened, far more than he is offended. He's curious. He's a youngish elephant bull. Oh, gosh, Ronald, I do hope you're okay, old pal. Look at the elephant's toenails. A, oh, dear. <laughs> oh, no. No, stop it! No. <laughs> That's Ronald's feed there, you can see. Uh, that means things are not as they should be. Anyway, listen, this Ronald thing... <laughs> I'm laughing because the dangerous Russian who does all our tech is going to be very cross with me indeed. I might sleep in the tent. Um, <laughs> okay. Now, just a quick bit of background to Ronald. It's a different way of engaging with the wild. It's obviously completely inanimate, but he does move. He has the scent of human beings. Now, elephants can get irritated. I said that that elephant wasn't offended by him. I was obviously entirely mistaken because that elephant was offended by him, and he's kicked him into the water. It's not ideal, I must confess. Let's have a quick look at the damn cat. Oh, dear. Uh, right, okay, well, at least he's not being leaked on. Yeah. Anyway, oh, God, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I thought I was going to do precisely the opposite. Now I'm really, oh, no. Sorry, Alex. I'm in a lot of trouble now. I'm so sorry, everybody. Right, anyway, so Ronald, uh, that's a deal I'll deal with Alex later. I'll probably sleep out where Steph is now. Uh, <laughs> I feel quite nauseous. So the Ronald's if basic, his modus operandi is to get a different view of the wilderness and to interact in a slightly different way. And obviously today was uh, not a particularly effective way for him to have interacted with the wilderness, but a great view nevertheless. <laughs> Let's head back to Tingana for now, and I will try and placate Rasputin the 